one that most of you well one either the hardest or the second hardest that most of you are going to run across. And lesson three is admitting your faults. Ooh, hit everybody right there, huh? Admit your faults. Can anybody tell me what I mean by admit your faults? Anybody. Admitting your faults means admitting everything that you've done and not done to achieve your goal, everything. So you want to make a list of your excuses going into this one. Every excuse you've ever found to not complete your dream, everything. I want you to jot it down, write it down, and then tell me what it was. Tell me what it was. Hmm? Hmm? All right. So. After that, jot down how many excuses, how many of those were just genuine excuses? If it was really as important as you say it is, if it's really as valuable as we just found out in step two, as you say it is, then why the excuses? Or are you saying, oh, well, I, I don't have the people, I don't have anybody to watch the kids while I do this. Take them with you. Well, I can't do it. Then do it at home. Well, I can't do it at home because, because why? We're in an age of technology that allows you to do everything at home. Everything. So for you to tell me it can't be done, can't, should not be in your vocabulary. Cannot should not be in your, your vocabulary. It's I had to alter this to get this done. Okay. The second question that I want you to think about this as we're going through step three of admitting your faults. And this is another crucial one. Did you commit? You see that? I'll make it a little bigger for you. There you go. Did you commit? Did you commit? Do you know what the word commit even means? How about that? Commit by definition means to pledge oneself to a position. Pledge yourself to a thing. What does pledge mean? Pledge is a solemn promise or agreement to do or refrain from doing something. So you pledged to do something. You promised, you signed an agreement and a, a verbal agreement with yourself to do something, to complete something, yet it has not been done. Over and over, you have pledged, air quotes, that you were going to make this happen, that you were going to follow this dream. You did that. You did that. And yet here you are one year, two year, three year, four years down the line or however many years it is. And it's still not done. Which means you promised yourself something and you didn't hold yourself to that promise. Did you commit? Because once you fully commit yourself to it, that means all those excuses that you just wrote down should no longer exist. All that value you just talked about, you should know what it means. You should, you should feel it in your, in your heart and your soul. All right. Now I'm not going to get too much deeper into that one, but we're going to go to the next one. Keep those things in mind though. Now,